Hi everyone, I'm Dom from Sony and I have the great pleasure of introducing to you the brand new Xperia Pro I. The I stands for imaging and this device has a huge emphasis on the camera. I mean, just look at the size of this thing. There is a lot to cover on this device, so let's dive right in. The triple lens camera at the back of this is made up of a 16mm ultra wide lens, a 50mm lens with optical image stabilization, and the main camera is a 24mm lens which also has optical image stabilization and is clearly hiding something awesome behind it. Let's take a closer look. The sensor in the main camera is huge. It's known as a 1.0 type image sensor and it's actually based on the same sensor that you'd find in a Sony RX100 Mark 7, the latest award-winning addition to the renowned RX100 range. Having this sensor in the main camera not only demonstrates the further integration of the top tier Sony technology in Xperia devices, but it also opens up a new world of possibilities and what a smartphone camera is capable of doing thanks to the power of the camera sensor and the processing power of the handset. Having a sensor this large means that you're able to capture far more light than before thanks to the pixel pitch being far larger at 2.4 micrometers. And this will help you produce better low light shots, capture a higher dynamic range, and achieve an intense natural bokeh on close-up subjects without the use of software to help blur out the background. There's even a dual aperture feature on the main camera to give you that extra versatility. You can switch from a 2.0 to a 4.0 aperture with a touch of a button to create dynamic close-ups and expansive landscapes. You also have the unbelievable speed of the technology from Alpha, giving you real-time eye autofocus and real-time tracking, and of course, 20 frames per second continuous burst mode on this new sensor, not to mention a dedicated front-end LSI to speed up image processing and to give you reduced noise in those burst shots. With that extra sensitivity and extra processing power, nighttime shots will be taken faster, you'll have better looking burst shots and better noise reduction in your photos. In addition to the 1.0 type image sensor and the extra processing power, Sony have also used Zeiss TSAR optics to help minimize any peripheral image distortion and deliver more intense contrast on the main 24 mm camera. And because this lens uses an aspherical glass lens element, this specially designed piece of glass helps collect light more efficiently and also helps with keeping the camera bump and the thickness of the handset to a minimum. You also benefit from the Zeiss T-Star coating on all three lenses to minimize reflections whilst shooting. Okay, so bigger sensor, better lens, more processing power, dedicated specifically to imaging. The pictures will obviously be amazing, but the video, well, not only is there an amazing new accessory specifically made for videographers, but there are also some phenomenal features for content creators to aid them in creating their best content for their audience. Introducing Videography Pro. Videography Pro joins its siblings Photography Pro and Cinematography Pro to round out the suite of apps aimed at content creators to help turn their ideas into a reality. It's perfect for videographers or vloggers shooting for YouTube or other social media platforms and gives you far more control over your video production by giving you access to focus settings, a powerful zoom on the main camera, shutter speed, ISO or gain, exposure control and white balance, plus the ability to monitor and control your audio. But that's not all. Sony has also introduced another groundbreaking piece of tech from Alpha to help creators make more engaging content. Eye autofocus and object tracking in video. Using this feature, not only can you track your subject's eye whilst they or the camera is moving, but you can also choose when to change the subject being tracked whilst you are shooting video to make your finished product more immersive and dynamic to your audience. You also benefit from Sony's optical steady shot with flawless eye for shake-free and stable videos, even in low light conditions. Another cool feature in Videography Pro is the ability to film in 4K in 120 frames per second natively, meaning you can actually save the 120 frames per second file to edit later instead of only having the slow motion file to work with in your edits. This gives you way more flexibility when putting together your final piece by introducing speed ramps or using the same footage at different speeds in your edits. You've also got a ton of extra versatility in Videography Pro by being able to adjust the aperture just like you can when you're taking photos in Photography Pro. 
and you can use the three and a half millimeter headphone jack to either plug in an external mic or to monitor your audio from the three microphones built into the handset a stereo pair to pick up general sound around you and a mono mic, which is in a more central position designed to capture your subject's voice. All of these microphones also support Sony's intelligent wind filter to filter out unwanted environmental noise as well. But the Xperia Pro i can also complement your existing video rig as well as becoming a fantastic addition to it, thanks to the external monitor feature found on the handset itself. Using this app, you can connect the Xperia Pro i to a compatible camera through a single cable and benefit from the larger, higher resolution screen and the impeccable color accuracy of the 4K HDR OLED display on the handset. Not to mention that this rig here can actually enable you to live stream to certain platforms using the external camera and the power of 5G on the Xperia Pro i to help you reach a brand new audience or perhaps even build your existing one. Speaking of external monitors, let me introduce to you the vlog monitor. This accessory means that you can take advantage of the main camera with its amazing hardware and capabilities whilst using Videography Pro or shooting in Photography Pro and keep an eye on how your shot is looking on the three and a half inch LCD display. Now, having an external display for vlogging is really cool, but let's take a closer look at this. The holder for the phone has a cold shoe attachment so you can mount an external microphone onto your rig. And the vlog monitor itself can attach to it via a magnet or be mounted onto a separate stand using the quarter inch screw thread. Then round the side you have some inputs. This three and a half millimeter jack to connect your external mic. Uh, this also supports stereo microphones as well. Your USB-C input for the display and power and a separate power input so you can attach an external battery for longer video shoots. Just a side note, when you connect an external battery to the vlog monitor, it will actually start powering the Xperia Pro i as well. And if that wasn't enough, the Xperia Pro i is compatible with Sony's versatile and highly recommended Bluetooth grip. That's right, you can link this existing accessory to your Xperia Pro i and use it as a Bluetooth remote in Photography Pro and Videography Pro. So you can start and stop your video, take photos, zoom and even use the custom key to switch between the rear lenses during your shoot. It goes without saying that the Xperia Pro i also has all the features that set the Xperia 1 Mark III apart from the competition. As I've mentioned, it has the same 21 by 9 4K HDR OLED display complete with Bravia technology to give you more color, contrast and clarity and also to widen the dynamic range of your content through Sony's HDR remastering in standard mode. You can also enable creator mode, powered by Cine Alta and inspired by Sony's master monitors as used by professionals in the movie industry. This mode lets you see the true color and quality of your content, and you can even customize when creator mode is enabled, so you can either kick back and enjoy your favorite film as the director intended you to see it, or it can help you monitor and edit your shots more accurately. The outstanding display can also be set to a 120Hz refresh rate to make scrolling and swiping beautifully smooth. But in addition to this, you can activate Sony's motion blur reduction technology in Game Enhancer, and this will give you an emulated 240Hz refresh rate whilst gaming for an unbeatably smooth experience. Sony's motion blur reduction is joined by a whole plethora of other features in Game Enhancer to literally enhance your gaming experience, such as heat suppression power control, which enables you to keep your Xperia Pro i plugged in whilst gaming and prevents your device from overheating, which otherwise would impede its performance and could damage the battery in the long run. You can also plug in a gaming headset into the 3.5mm headphone jack and make sure your voice cuts through the game audio with Sony's voice chat optimization options or sculpt your own sound in the audio equalizer to help you hear where your enemies are coming from and give you that tactical edge. Focus settings let you customize your gaming session so you can really zone in on the task at hand. And in the record menu, you can record your entire gaming session complete with your own mix of game audio and audio from your mic in high quality and in 120 frames per second to be edited afterwards. Or you can simply enable rewind time record and the Xperia Pro i will be constantly recording the last 30 seconds of gameplay footage. So if something unexpected happens, you already have the recording saved. 
It also shares the Xperia 1 Mark III's entertainment features with high-res audio support and the DSEE Ultimate to upscale your MP3s or streamed music to near high-res audio quality, just as the artist intended you to hear it. You can also experience music in a new way with Sony's 360 spatial sound feature to give you a more immersive audio experience and make it feel like the music is surrounding you. And of course you have Dolby Atmos for multi-dimensional cinematic sound through wired or wireless headphones or the full stage stereo front facing speakers on the device. The Xperia Pro i also features a sizable 4,500 mAh battery and Sony's renowned battery technologies such as stamina mode, battery care, and Xperia adaptive charging. Stamina mode will help you get the most out of your battery and can be customized to fit your needs so that you never get caught short on power. Whereas Xperia adaptive charging and battery care ensure that your battery is never overworked whilst on charge day or night, which means that you can benefit from a healthy battery even after three years of use. The Xperia Pro i brings groundbreaking innovation, convenience, versatility, and an unmatched attention to detail with content creators in mind. I mean, even the little things on this handset really add up to help deliver a certain cameraness that you don't get anywhere else. For example, the embossed camera button using the same mechanical components as the Sony RX100 Mark VII for a deeper and more realistic shutter feed, or the built-in strap hole on the frame for secure one-handed shooting, and the extra shortcut key on the side which can be reassigned to open any app you like, which can really help speed up your workflow as a photographer or videographer. In a lot of ways, the Xperia Pro i is a totally unique device, thanks to the introduction of the RX100 hardware and the renowned technology from Alpha, all housed in a smartphone that can help you as a content creator get your ideas to your audience faster. And of course, the whole creative process can be made even easier with the addition of the vlog monitor accessory. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the Sony Xperia YouTube channel for the latest in products, tips and news. And also to order the Xperia Pro i or to find out more, just visit the Sony website.